said Jesus said in your Bible that he's coming back. So are the so words of Jesus say, So here we are again, Yusuf. Are the words of Jesus of in the course. Bible? There are some of words of Jesus in the Bible. It's, yes, no, of course. It's, it's, either we, we words, it's either his words are in the no, Bible no, no. or not. You no, know, my friend, we believe the Bible is truth, but it has been manipulated. This is what we believe. So we don't believe so that the whole you, Bible. So hold on a second. So how do you know what are the words of Jesus or not? Because we have confirmation from Islam, who, the, the messenger who came from God many years later after Jesus Christ, he told us that Jesus Christ will come back. So where does, so wait, now wait, I tell him wait, wait, wait. Where, do, where does Muhammad say that Jesus said he will come back? How, uh, one moment, just a moment. Hello, welcome to Religious Insight. On this video, a Muslim claims to rely on the word of Jesus until God logic show him this. Let's watch this video to get more details. Yusuf, how you doing? Yeah, my friend, how are you doing? Do you remember me? Uh, I don't. Maybe if we start talking some more, it'll probably click. All right. I'm Yusuf from Egypt. First of all, let me introduce yourself. Assalamu alaikum, everybody. I'm Muslim. I'm Yusuf from Egypt. <clears throat> and I've been listening to your uh, podcast here. I, I'm new to TikTok. My mm -hmm. English is not that good. Before mm -hmm. everybody starts uh, yeah, mocking my English, <laughs> um, uh, English is my third language. Um, so yes, the topic is uh, Jesus is God. Change my mind. Yes, um, um, I don't have to change your mind, but I uh, I want to comment about uh, my previous uh, brother who was uh, was you were speaking about uh, Aisha. I, 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 I said before bringing you up. I don't know if you heard me. I said that I do not want to talk about the Aisha thing. He brought it up. He wanted to talk about that when we were t originally talking about Christianity, but he did want okay, okay, my perspective okay. on that. So, uh, so I said that let's talk about the subject for the guests that come up. I literally said that, my friend. Right. All right. It's okay. It's okay. If you want me to just uh, to clarify something, uh, uh, if you may, let me clarify something. I only and want, I only, I only want you, you to. Want... I only want you to talk about the subject. I don't know if I was clear on that. I okay, felt like I was clear. It's okay. All right, all right. Uh, l last time I called, um, I didn't have my laptop as I was in. I was not in my office. I was in uh, at home. Now I have my laptop uh, in front of me. So um, let's 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 start by asking you a question. Um, to make someone God or to claim that someone is God, uh, uh, w what are the things that should be in that uh, human? To be God, if there is a human being, we want to we want to say, say that He's God. We have to witness some of His miracles, right? Yes. Did you witness any of His miracles? Yes, I believe I believe I I have, I have personal Sorry. miracles in my own life. But if you're just going no, on, no, if no, you're no, just going on, if you're just going on, if you're just going on the script, well, Jesus says, "Blessed is." So this is what this is. What, I, I like your question. Thomas said that he mm. wouldn't believe until he saw Jesus, and then Jesus appeared to him. And then Thomas called him uh, and said, you know that he's Jesus. "Hold on, hold on." He, well, Jesus showed him his his the hands, his hands, and you know his side, the holes in his hands, because he was crucified and he rose again. He was like, "Look, it's me. Put your hands, put your fingers in my holes. It's me. Put your hand on my side. It's me." So, uh, so Thomas at first didn't believe until he saw him, and then Thomas saw him and saw the miracle with his own eyes and. He called Jesus his Lord. He said, my Lord and my God. That's what he called Jesus. Jesus responded with him to him and said, you believe because you see me. Blessed are those who believe without even seeing. So even if I never saw personally Jesus himself, I am blessed for believing in who he is, even without seeing him. He is my Lord and my God. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I, I totally, I totally agree with you. But um, honestly, how can we believe him? Yani, uh, first because of all, he, because what, he rose what, from the dead. No, 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 not Jesus. I'm not speaking about how can we believe uh, someone who said I've seen Jesus. He told me that I'm Jesus, and he wrote it in a book. And now you're asking me to follow just someone who saw something, who thought that it was uh, a messenger, and the messenger told him that. He's a well, God. no. So, well, I, well, no. It's because they have a ver veracity of attestation, meaning they have a lot of testimony. It's not just believing one person, but my you friend, have my friend, multiple. I can, I can, let me I, let me finish. I can claim. Let me let okay. me finish. Thank you. You have multiple witnesses that attest to seeing Jesus, 
and his miracles and his claims. And then you have the emergence of the church was his evidence of his resurrection. This boom of this belief in Jesus and as the resurrected Lord, right? So you have this evidence on why you should believe that Jesus is your Lord and God. I, you know what? I accept uh, uh, Jesus as uh, as as the, the the path as the path of right. I accept Jesus that He's one of the mightiest human beings who ever lived. The and mightiest. This is, uh, the mightiest. Not one of. He's the mightiest. Sorry. He's the mightiest. Not one of. He is the mightiest. The no, no, the the might. Yes, I totally agree. I mm -hmm. totally agree. Mm -hmm. But you know, where 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 we uh, we, we we are different. Uh, I don't have to rely on someone who did not. Um, I, I rely on Jesus Christ's words. For example, now, uh, sorry, I didn't get your name. My name is Yusuf, by the way. My this name is my name is, name. My, name is I... a, my, my name is Avery. But you don't rely on Jesus's words. You reject them. Avery. Yeah, just a moment. Let me clarify. Now Jesus will return. Correct. Yeah, where does Jesus say that? In your belief, not in my belief. Jesus no, you, will return, you, right? You believe you in your belief. You believe Jesus will return. Where did um, you, just where, just uh, Jesus? The, where does the, Jesus the, say the that? Question is, my friend. The, uh, the question is, Jesus is God. Change my mind. Yeah, I'm but you said that you, you said that you said you said that you were lie. You said that you said that you were lie, Yusuf. You said you were lie on the words of Jesus. You just you yeah, just, made just a, a moment. You just made a claim about uh -huh. Jesus saying that he returns. Where does Jesus say that? Yes, you teach me. Uh, in your belief, does he, does he return or he doesn't return? Oh, we believe that he returns because we have the words of Jesus. Do you? Great, great, great. Do you great. have the words of Jesus, when, Yusuf? When, when, just a moment, just a moment. No, it's not when just a returns. moment. It's, it's not just a moment. Do you have the words of Jesus? Of course we do. Oh, really? Of course we okay, do. so where does Jesus say we, that he's going to return? We have the words that Jesus was saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we have the yeah. words. That, Good. So, the where, of so where do you get it from? where jesus says he will return we got it from the same source that jesus himself was getting it from so where do you we get got this it from? Where, from where 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 is it uh just a moment i'll i'll, I'll bring it up because I, I i'm one of the bad muslims i don't memorize the whole mushaf the whole quran oh no you're so right you're, you're, right. you're not a bad you're a regular muslim no no there's hardly any muslims that memorize the quran. No, no 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 believe me believe me i'm like from the 60 percent population who does not memorize the whole quran i, I would say i, I, I would say i would say i would say 90. i would say you're part of the 90 percent that doesn't memorize the quran um maybe in the us but i'm not here my friend <laughs> Um, um um but honestly you know what i'm looking it up right now but um um uh but uh, but uh, honestly this is taking me away from the subject the main subject because i had a point and you you i i lost uh, lost track of it can when i can you, i just when, explain when, my point and then you, go back when you when you, you say something no i'm sorry when you say something i have to hold you to it as a muslim uh, oh, uh, you're saying that you, <laughs> you you're saying that you rely on the words of jesus where does no, jesus I say that he's we, coming back um, from the Bible, right? There you go. You get it from the Bible. So you're saying that the Bible has the words of Jesus? Uh, no. <laughs> ah, so you see how that how yeah, some, you see how you're yeah, in yeah. trouble there? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm see? not in trouble. By the way, we as Muslims, as Muslims, as Muslim, we believe that Jesus was um, it was not crucified, was not killed. Yeah. So he you don't believe you don't believe Jesus's words One when moment. Jesus says, "I will be crucified. I was crucified, and I rose again on the third day," as the scripture how? said. Okay, you don't okay, you don't okay, you don't believe me. Jesus' words. This is my point. My my point sorry, is Yusuf. Sorry. Yusuf. My show point me is me Yusuf. Relax. My point my is friend. Yusuf is that you <laughs> said and I was and I and I, I don't want to I I I'm trying to refrain from saying you lied, but you know I'm I'm you know hopefully we don't get there. But I would say that you were being disingenuous when you said that you as a Muslim you rely on the words of Jesus. Yet I asked you, where do you get the words of Jesus that he's coming back? You said the Bible. And I'm like, okay, so does the Bible have the words of Jesus? You said no now. And you, and you chuckled because you see the problem there. 
So do you no no so do you rely on okay. the words of Jesus or not? Uh, just a moment, just a moment. Uh, let me clarify. We have a hadith from Rasul, peace be upon him, that Jesus will return. I don't care about I I I, respectfully. I do not care about what any of your hadith say. Where does Jesus anyway, say? We, where does Jesus say he's coming nice. back? Very nice. Listen, my friend, don't be like this. Just let us have a smooth conversation. And we are trying, we're two grown ups. We're trying to have a smooth conversation. You, you're trying to show your point of view. I'm trying to show my point of view. You, you, if this you, is a you, debate, you, you I'm know, really, I'm not, in, I'm not interested. So, so but then, that, so, then so then, you, I, so I, then I would suggest, my friend, if you don't like I, the, I, the way that this conversation is going, I no, would no, suggest no, no, no. that you drop. I like it. Oh, you do? No, no. I, I, okay. I, so, I like so, this, so, this is, so this is so this is so this is how this goes, Yusuf. I will mm -hmm. allow you to make your point and say what you got to say, as long as you're direct, you. as long as you're Thank honest. You. So don't waste my Thank time. You. I won't waste your time. Thank you. Be honest. I'm gonna be honest with you. So what okay. I'm saying is, when you say we have hadith where Muhammad says things, the reason why I said I don't care about that is because I didn't ask for a hadith from Muhammad. I said, where but is Jesus? You, where, Bible, you said you rely. You said you rely on the words of Jesus. Because, listen, my friend, where do we get our religion as Muslims? Where do, do we, did we see Jesus Christ? Did you see him? Did we? Did I see him? We we didn't see him. But we as Muslims, we had a prophet who said from the source, who is God, the only God, the the, the Father uh, from your point of view, uh, that um, Jesus will return. What did I you, ask? You, you, you tell me. What did you I tell ask? Me, you tell me. What did yeah, I ask? Yeah, you tell me. How do you follow the words of Jesus? What did I ask? I said Jesus said in your Bible that he's coming back. So are the so words of Jesus? Say, so here we are again, Yusuf. Are the words of Jesus of in the course, Bible? There are some of words of Jesus in the Bible. Yes, no, of course. It's either, we, we don't... Words, it's either his words are in the no, Bible no, no. or not. No, my friend, we believe the Bible is truth, but it has been manipulated. This is what we believe. So we don't believe so that the whole you, Bible... So, so hold on a second. So how do you know what are the words of Jesus or not? Because we have confirmation from Islam, who the, the messenger who came from God many years later, after Jesus Christ, he told us that Jesus Christ will come back. So where does... So wait, now wait, I tell him wait, no wait. prophet. Where, do, where does Muhammad say that Jesus said he will come back? How, uh, one moment, just a moment. <clears throat> this is what I mean by disingenuous. It's a dis disingenuous argument. We rely on the what, words what of does, Jesus. What, what does it? We rely on the words of Jesus. Where do you get this from? The Bible. Oh, so the Bible has the words of Jesus? No. What? No, no, no. I say yes. I said yes. Sorry, I, I, I didn't understand your question the first time. I told you now. I told you yes. It has the words of Jesus. Okay. But it has been manipulated. Would you? Okay. Would you like to? Don't, don't okay. Say okay. So the part that's the part where Jesus says that he's coming back. You're saying that that's the true words of Jesus. Is that correct? Of course. Yes. Okay. So let me read you. Let me read you where Jesus says this. Let's let's see. All right. Now watch watch yes. you switch up. You said that this is the real words of Jesus. I guarantee you, you're gonna switch. Watch. This is what Jesus says. When the Son of Man comes, of watch. Okay. When the Son okay. of Man comes, this is Matthew chapter 25, verse starting at verse 31. When the Son of Man comes in his glory and all the angels with him, then he will sit on his glorious throne. And before him will be gathered all the nations, and he will separate people from one another as a shepherd separates sheep from the goats and he will place the sheep on his right, but the goats on the left. Then the king will say to those on his right, come you who are blessed by my father, inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. To those on his left, he will say, depart from me, you workers of iniquity I, into the eternal fire prepared for the devil and his angels. So this is what Jesus says. Wow. He's going to come with glory in his own glory. And he says that he will sit on his glorious throne on the day of judgment. And he will judge yes, the nations. And that he is the king on the day of judgment. 
Are these Jesus' words? <clears throat> these are, man, you are really, really uh, on points. But there is a small problem in what you're saying that this is not his return. This is judgment day. This is this, judgment day. This is his return. This is not the return on earth. No, 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 no. This, this is, is his judgment. Day. My friend, his return, he will come back on earth. He will. Yes, he's going to judge on earth. What you said right now is that he's going to sit on his uh, glorious throne. Um, uh -huh. uh, glorious, uh, and he will judge people. Yeah, on earth. And the, the goat will spray the sheep. This is not the return. This is ju judgment day. On earth. But in Islam, my, Yusuf, my friend, how, Yusuf, how, how, how Yusuf, judgment day is going to be? Yusuf, he's coming yes. to earth where people reside. He's going to separate them. Where are the people? What planet are they on? Mm -hmm. What planet are the people so, on? So, yeah, yeah, so he, Jesus is going to come back to earth to ju judge people. That's correct. And the people who died, what is he going to do with them? He's going to resurrect them. So this is judgment day. This is not the return of Jesus. On earth. Yes, but this... My friend, Jesus, so this is something new I'm learning from you. So you believe that Jesus is coming back and he will resurrect everyone. So you believe, you want me to believe that this earth is going to hold every single human being that has been uh, created. The same earth we are on right now, which is very crowded, by the way. He will resurrect everything. Yeah, he's coming to earth, uh, according to Jesus. He's coming to earth. And he will, and he will resurrect according, every single according human to, According to Jesus? Yep, he's coming to earth. No, my friend, this is according to your book. What we believe in. Jesus and what and what did I and what did I say you're gonna do? I literally I said, said that your book is manipulated. What did I say? I said that as soon as I read this, you're gonna switch. I said no, no, so no, the no, words no, of I'm Jesus stop. You're I said words the words of Jesus. I said the words of Jesus, where he says that he's coming back. These are the true words of Jesus, right? You said yes. And then I said, okay, I'm going to read it. And I said, I guarantee you, you're going to switch. And lo and behold, Prophet Avery is right again. You switch. <laughs> Man, calm down. It's not like this. I did not switch. I still, I, I'm by my word. I'm, I'm with you. Jesus will come. You're not and with I'm me. with you. You're not with me. Because you let's, reject let's the words of Jesus. Let, 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 let me elaborate. Let me elaborate, please. My friend. What is yeah. Sorry, guys. I had to restart because there's a little bit of a delay. He will destroy the cross. He will um, uh, will uh, uh, slaughter the swine, hey, Yusuf, and then he unites. Hey, Yusuf, the Yusuf, of God. Yusuf, what's what's my argument? What's my argument? I don't care. What, I don't. I don't care about the Islamic see, point of view. What's see, my argument? See, 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 this is what I've been doing. I, I've been trying to negotiate your argument, and you've been trying to take me into loopholes. What's my well, argument? How, how did you get the Jesus? What's my argument? Jesus has got changed my mind. Jesus, God, change my mind. Hey, Yusuf, so take, me, take care of yourself. Let me ask you the question again. Take care. Get out of here. Really? Take care of yourself. We saw enough. Thanks for proving me to be a prophet again. I said that you were going to switch and show your disingenuousness. One second, one second, my brother. I'm pretty good. I said, I showed you. I said that you were going to switch. As soon as I read the words of Jesus, and you did exactly that. Oh, well, no, this has been manipulated. But you said at first these were the true words of Jesus talking about his coming. Now, all of a sudden, because it disagrees with you, it's been manipulated. You Muslims are dishonest. You're disingenuous. You cannot argue genuinely. You have no intellectual integrity. You have no integrity when it comes to the text. No exegesis. You can't do it because, as a Muslim, you can't. The second you're honest, you'll become an ex-mist. Hi, welcome back. I believe you're able to learn something new. Let us know your views about this video in the comment section. And in case you have not subscribed to this channel, please do like to subscribe. Hit the, the notification button to be notified each time we post new and engaging videos like this. The hypocrisy of Islam is one of the four driving this religion forward and nothing else. He asked God logic if he saw any miracle of Jesus and that, but how can he as a Muslim believe the testimony of people he never met for just reading their testimony from a book so he cannot trust their testimony. But it never occurred to him that he never met Muhammad nor his companion and yet he believes in Islam 
and what the, the Muhammad and his companion wrote down about Jesus. The Christians and both the Muslims of nowadays didn't see Jesus and we didn't see Muhammad neither but the both sides believe in whatever testimony that was recorded. So trying to discredit Christianity by just saying that you cannot believe in the Bible because of what was written down by the people he didn't meet has also discredited his Quran. So if they go by this logic, it shows that the Quran also should not be trusted first. The irony of the whole thing is that he rejected the gospel because of the disciples of Jesus and he accepted what another person who came over 600 years later has said about Jesus. Trust me, God logic is doing a very, very wonderful work debating with these guys. You don't know how stressful this kind of work can be around here. The level of back and forth of debate with this guy is brain draining and it is somehow exhausting. There is no way you can accept someone or their personality and reject their words. You can't accept the person of Jesus and reject his words and his essence. It doesn't work that way. The proof that you believe and accept Jesus is that you accept his word also. The reason why many of them are fighting the word of Jesus so much is because of the foundation Muhammad set up for them. If Muhammad didn't reject the deity of Jesus, there wouldn't be need for all these lies and deniers to cover up their tracks. Sometimes it is really, really pathetic listening to these guys in a debate like this. Guys, let us know your views about this video in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more engaging videos like this. Thank you for watching. See you in our next video.